Hi folks, uh, Robert here. I want to give you this quick little uh, tutorial on dealing with uh, symbols and annotations. So what you'll see here, you'll see uh, we have 14 millimeter diameter typical. Uh, now, Rivet has doesn't Rivet doesn't have characters in its annotations. So I'm going to activate this view and I'll take it and. Um, you can't, so if I want to say an at symbol, you can do that. But a uh, diameter symbol, um, I think that would be shift six. No. So in AutoCAD, you can bring some of these over. But what uh, Autodesk does, it uses Microsoft's uh, character symbol. So how to, how to activate that is, I'm going to just drag this out a bit. So you want to go and uh, go into your Microsoft search and this key in character. There it is, character map right here. And then uh, should open up soon. Okay, there it is. So now once I get this character map, I'll get all these symbols. So for diameter, that would be this guy. So you just select it, and then you copy it. And once you copy it, you can come over in the rivet. Oh, cancel that. You come in a rivet in this text, and you can just go and pull that over like so, and just right click and paste. And there's our diameter symbol. I'll say yes to that and just pull it over. Uh, let's bring that backspace. Backspace. Oh. So that's how you place characters in your um, text. So you can do other characters, so percent signs, whatever you can get into uh, Rivet. So let me try something else. Let's try another one here. So you go back to your character map. Should be out here somewhere. There it is. So bring that up to right here. Or I could just tab to it. There you go. And so these are all the symbols available. So uh, again, uh, let's do another one here. Let's go with. Uh, oh shoot. So we have uh, we have many 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 symbols you can use. So, uh, like I said, Autodesk doesn't uh, provide uh, symbols. You can do different fonts. Uh, let's go with Arial, which is what we use in Revit, and we can do a degree sign here. So let's say uh, we're 21. Let me say right here, 21. Bring my character map back here. And I'll take the little degree sign, I'll select it. Oh, I want to backspace that. I want to select the degree sign, copy it, go back into my uh, text, annotations text, and go right click and paste. So that's how you use the character map. So you don't really have to type in diameter or whatever. You can get all of these symbols right out of the character map in Autodesk. So I want to make sure this quick video has to show some people how this works. And uh, so thanks for watching and like this or comment on it. You got a better way to do it. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.